What's going on, everybody? Here I am, the hardest working eBay seller on YouTube. Cha, that's me. <laughs> I didn't say smartest. I said hardest working and best looking. Hmm. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> all right, I'm going to get into this uh, after I take this offer for this hat. I am going to get into just the last uh, Goodwill outlet bins pickup I got. Bunch of junk, bunch of stuff, bunch of stuff to resell, make some money, make some money. Yesterday was a good selling day. Did about $1,100 yesterday. Today, where am I at? This dude pays me. Some dude came in and bought like $300 worth of those promo CD singles that I like to sell. Now you know why I like to sell them. And I gave him a good deal on them just because he was buying so many. I'm like, take them, take them, take them. They've been in the store for a while. Take them, take them, take them. He still hasn't paid me yet, though. <clears throat> if he would pay me so today, it would put me over big time. I got two and a half hours left in my day. I'm at $700. So hopefully he'll pay me before 10 p.m. Central Time. Then I'll definitely be over my... 1k mark which i would like to be i would like to be i would like to be that that be my normal everyday dollar amount that is the goal for the hardest working ebay seller on youtube all right uh i just picked up a bunch of different stuff a hockey stick not in bad shape this is a lundquist version lundquist if you're a hockey fan you know lundquist uh, knew they're about 54 bucks, so might be able to get 20, 25 out of it. So I'll grab that. Got all kinds of stuff here, man. Of course, mostly, mostly my uh, foundation stuff, hats and shirts and clothes. But I do have a Lego clock. Lego clock. They're usually not worth too much. I haven't looked him up, but I usually get about 10 bucks a piece out of them. See, just some normal hats. Where am I gonna throw this stuff? Dun, 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 dun. It's not a bad Cardinals. Oh, Stitches. Stitches is a good brand. I like getting Stitches stuff when it comes with it comes with, to sporting goods. It's usually really heavy duty uh, brand. And a lot of times they have a good look to them, a little good design. Some are have the, uh, here I go again, forgetting common words. Distressed, has a distressed look to them. So this one doesn't, but you can feel the quality in it. Ah, Washington U. Let's see. That's a Nike hat. Rams Christmas hat. Got that one a little late, huh? Doesn't say St. Louis, so that's even a more bonus. Another Boeing. I saw Boeing all the time. Boeing, Boeing, Boeing. What do we got here? Oh, yeah, I saw this. I didn't know what it was for exactly. If anything, it just says Mexican Linda. Lindo. Mm. Oh, hey, baby, what's your name? <laughs> She's got cleavage. I've always said cleavage could create world peace. It could. It's powerful stuff. What is this? It's a marvel. Red chapter. Red. Yeah, red chapter, whatever it is. Oh, Captain America. <laughs> okay. Okay. Here we go. A nice little. I love grabbing Echo stuff, man. Definitely need some cleaning. I like that. I like it. Bam. Oh, yeah. Let's get down with my bad self. Hello. 
I'd like to thank you for coming to my video today. Thank you, and uh, we'll have a little, this mic kind of sucks. Let me, uh, thank you for coming to my video today, and uh, we're gonna play a little song for you. Uh, let's get into this. I like to call that my white boy rhythm. And I guess it didn't record properly. I won't record that. I see. All right. That's cool. Retract. Ooh, that's got a retracting action. That's kind of cool. Oh, yeah. White boy rhythm. There we go. Oh, I don't think I can get those stains out, though. Oh, maybe. We'll try. Which, ooh, yeah, nice. Even better. We're definitely going to try to get those stains out. Hazelwood Skate Park. I'd like to thank everybody for watching my Goodwill Hall pickup. So you can see another shirt. Cardinal shirt. James, this is the first time you ever bought a Cardinal shirt. What we got here? When guns are outlawed, I will be an outlaw. This should go over real well right now. Yes, it should. What what state is that they're trying to do that stuff in right now? Virginia? Is it Virginia? I don't know. I don't know. Rock Summer Hideaway. That looks like Chili's Rolling Rock. But it has a Chili's apostrophe. So Rolling Rock and Chili's. Oh, Chili's Chicken Cajun Pasta. Minus the onions. Bring me out some extra powder so I can douse that. Oh, I feel so bloated after I leave there. I get the chips, I get the pasta, I get the little cool ass like toast they bring out. Oh. <laughs> so bloated, so bloated. It's a cool little Nike shirt. Third annual shake, rattle, and pour. TGI Fighters, it's the Bartender Olympics. That's a thing? That is a thing, apparently. A soldier's wish list. Bartender's champion. Uh -huh. All right. Two of those. Two of them. Here is a Nike Swoosh League 99. Is this reversible? Yes, it is. There's the Nike tag. Reversible. Reversible. St. Louis Rams Vintage Sweats. Been selling a lot of these overseas. Going overseas. 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 City Bank. Remember that City Bank jacket I sold? That was, that was a good find. Good find. Stephen Barry. Bare Knuckle Boxing. You gotta be tough to be bare knuckle. I was excited about this one until I took a closer look. I thought I saw a hole in it, but God smack. I thought I might be able to keep that one, but it looks like a 2XL though. A little big for me, there's the hole right there, but I'm uh, sure it'll still sell. What else we got here? <laughs> Tested positive. Pooling team. With the stain, I don't know who's gonna come out. Breckenbridge. 
snowboarding is it? Snowboarding? St. Louis Cardinals. President's Cup. Hello. Guess the batteries are dead. I'll simulate the monkey playing in. All right, Mizzou, Florida Marlins, Chicago. That's just a, Chicago. It's kind of a cool hat though. Dallas, X32, Boeing, air to surface standoff missile, Air Force Navy. All right. All righty then. Uh, Suns, I guess some little league team of some sort. Philadelphia Eagles. Mizzou, I think I got that one in the store already. Dallas. Cowboys, fishing vessel, Dallas, Dallas, Cardinals. I know I got one of these in the store if it hasn't sold. Cardinals, the Dunes. I'm guessing that's a golf course. Kate Lord uh, visor. New York Yankees. Hey, bam. Put you over here. What we got next? Ah, Point Fest. Local radio station. Every year they have a, a show or two at the amphitheater. And they bring in bands to play. Alternative. And stuff similar to that. Like your older alternatives. Actually, I met my wife at a Point Fest. I was working it because I was working in a local music store and we had a booth set up there and we had local bands signing their CDs and what have you for the local audience. And I didn't get to watch a show. I wanted to go see Run DMC that year. I think they were there that year. I didn't get to go see them, but I met her at Point Fest. So pretty cool. Pretty cool. Scooby Dooby Doo. Alrighty. Hunt, fish, fish, hunt. Nothing else matters. Nothing else matters. Alrighty. Jesus is my boss. I think I got one of them in my store too. Cardinals. Some little league team. Well, that ain't generic, is it? What the hell are they trying to do there? Yeah, all right. 10 point crossbows. Hey, Rams. Doesn't say St. Louis, so. Uh, the buyers, the buyers. Whoever that is. Whoever, whoever. Another US Open. I found tons of US Open stuff over there. Huskers. 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 Okay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, there we go. I like these. Pepsi. And it has the Pepsi label. There we go. I like finding these. I like it. I like it. I like it. Oh, yeah. There we go. That's a nice vintage piece. 1995. Starter. Single stitch. And it's raining again. And the good thing... Don't say St. Louis. 95. When did the Rams come to St. Louis? I don't even remember. I, was never, I went to one game. <laughs> uh, St. Louis Rams. 
started. Let's see if this is a a uh, Los Angeles piece or if it's a St. Louis piece. Uh, Rams located from Los Angeles to St. Louis in 1995. So this was right at the transition. So pretty cool. What's for me? It's a Nike shirt. Just do it. I gotta get those stains off of there. Looks like somebody was brushing their teeth and went a little wild or something. Was it? <laughs> Vancouver 2010 Olympics. Nice jacket. That's a good piece, as long as I don't find no rips or anything in it. Canada Olympics. That's like a quality jacket right there. What do we got here? Did you know Purgle? Purgle. Another US Open. Tee it up. Find a lot of golf stuff around here. A lot of golf stuff. What do we got here? Washington University. This looks like an older piece, too. All the way around. Let's take a look at the tag. Charles River Apparel. Not sure how old it is, but. Bam. Kentucky Derby. Another Talus. Tons of Talus. And here. A pair of Nikes, a pair of curving, cur curving, curving, why can't I say his name? Irving, not curving, Irving. I can't speak today. Kyrie Irving. Good Lord. Look how long it took to get that, get that name out. I can't read that tag. We're going to throw you aside for now. Kyrie Irving. Dag Nevitt. Learn to speak the English language if you're going to make YouTube videos. Sacred Heart Golf Tournament. Let me put all these over here. Jesus is my boss. All right. All right, what we got here? ESPN. I have a lot of luck with ESPN stuff selling pretty quickly. So hopefully that will be of the same. Had to get a little fanny pack. Get a little get a little 80s up in here. Alright, what we got here? Oh, there's another Nike swoosh league. I did not realize I had two. The other one was brought over to me from a friend, decided he didn't want it. This one I didn't even realize I had. Same older tag on it. Pretty kick ass thing. I got two, I got two, I got two. That's a cool, that's like suede. That's like silky smooth, silky smooth. It's all polyester though, but it feels so good. It smelled pink. Oh, oh, oh. All righties. Indians. Cry for the Indians. Die for the Indians. Vance Auto Park. They've been working on their car. Croatia. That's a kick ass looking hat, ain't it? Say yes. Yes, it is. Cru cruise size. Cruiser size. That's, I guess, working out on a cruise ship. WrestleMania. We got Cena, The Rock, Randy Orton, Rey Mysterio, CM Punk. Uh, Why do I always forget his name? Redhead dude. Seamus. Seamus? No, yeah, Seamus. And is that The Miz? The Miz? Smooth seas never made a skilled sailor. Okay. Alrighty. 
I found a puppet. I found a puppet from 1992. I found a puppet. And I can't really get my hands in it. It's not very good as a puppet. But it's Lamb Chop! Looky there. It's Lamb Chop. Queensryche. Good album. Love me some Queensryche. Promised Land. It's got I Am I on it. I Am I. And this also has Bridge, right? Or, yeah, Bridge. Good song. I Am I. Good song. This whole album is just very good. I like it. Joel Cocker. Songs of the Eagles by Country Artists. The Marines. The Few. The Proud, the Marines. Fozzie Bear. My dad was in the Marines. Fozzie, what year are you from? But uh, I think I told that story. He was in hospital most of his young life from polio. And Shriners finally ended up paying for his uh, surgery after what six it's been six or eight years laying in a hospital bed I could not imagine that and then when he got out he lied about his age and joined the Marines Ballsy bum. we've got Winnie the Pooh saying happy birthday to you oh he does have a battery pack in here maybe he does sing Maybe he does. One of these guys. I think I just put one of these up. Just like him. This is that, uh, what's that Wii game? But had a whole bunch of these there, but I had to get Jack just to put him in my room here. Being on my Nightmare Before Christmas fan. Two more little totes here to go. We'll be done. M I C K E Y M O U S E. Mickey Mouse Donald Duck. Mickey Mouse Donald Duck. This is mine. You ready? This is going up in here. Bam. Blues. I think we'll put my jerseys up back here. They kind of cover things up. Give a nice little backdrop to the videos. I have my jerseys. I've got Perron jersey. I've got my name on a couple of jerseys. I got a Brett Hull jersey. And I got a bunch of other just random blank jerseys. I love my blues jerseys. It's pretty much the only thing I really collect blues anymore is the jerseys. Everything else I pretty much have sold. Something like this, I'll maybe tag it to the ceiling since I want to put more hanging stuff in here. But uh US open again. Cardinals again. Chaps, Ralph Lauren. Pretty cool jacket. Heavy duty jacket. Oh, got an offer. Let's see what I got here. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Sold a Mario hat. And $20 for that TV combo dvd player i had it's up for 44.99 you're offering me 20 and arizona you know how expensive that would be to ship that to arizona hell no hell no decline decline i only paid what three dollars for that i believe if i remember the video correctly but i can't let it go for 20 bucks when arizona because arizona now if it was ohio I might counter at 30 because it wouldn't cost as much to, for me to send it to being in Missouri to send it to say Ohio as compared to Arizona. Got some little foam posits. This is the oil slicks. The oil slick. I love that texture on it. The oil slick foam posits. <laughs> I picked this up because it looked old and I forgot to open it up to check it out. It's a tablecloth, I'm guessing here. Now I'm looking at it, being it's around the edges, like a Christmas tablecloth, it looks like. 
don't see a tag on it or yeah it's seamed all the way around so it's got to be probably a tablecloth the north face nice north face jacket well is there ain't any hidden issues and one more left Found a bunch of Boy Scouts, not a bunch, but several. Got this big piece, but it's got all these patches on it. So I probably have to pull the patches off. Let's see. Maybe I'll just keep them on there and sell it like it is, cause they're all the way around. But I found a couple of uniforms with patches on them too, I do believe. If I remember correctly, in here somewhere, Cobalt. Alaska. I want to take a cruise. Alaska cruise. Bling bling, baby. Golf and Sea Club. That's an older looking hat. I like that. Oh, nice. Disney Institute. Is that the Art Institute they have there? I know. I think they're they're. Uh, if I remember correctly, it's been a while since I had one, like the Disney Art Institute or Art Studios or something. And they're kind of an artistic Mickey shirt or whatever. Those sell for decent money. Honda Factory Performance. Cabela's. Cardinals. Lowe's. Logan River. I got a sneeze coming on here soon in a second. I can feel it. It's a Nike. <coughs> Anheuser Busch. Huh. At what age does like <laughs> sneezes can sneezes take you out? And what do you die from? Mm, a sneeze. Here we go. Now I'll put all these in one big lot since they're all the St. Louis area. Got a lot of patches, a lot of patches. So I'll put them in a lot and keep them together. I think this is the other one. Whoa, stay. I do not give you permission to fall. There we go. Yeah, we'll keep those together. Bercardi. Oh, there's a whole bunch here. So I got the. I love finding these. I've said it before in other videos. And actually, I just sold one. And I got not one of these, not a handkerchief, basically. I forget what it was for, though. I think I got six bucks out of it. There's three here of these. This is their light. Easy to pack. Audi Daw. Audi Daw. Duchenne, Duchenne, Saka, 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 Saka. This is God's country. Please don't drive through it like hell. Alrighty then. Nineteen ninety-seven, Kansas City, cheap set, vintage piss. And the Rams hat. Another cardinal shirt. <laughs> oh yeah, that's what the tag was for. Petables. It's a, it's a bat dog costume. <laughs> New with tags. No, that's a kid. Why does it say petables? <laughs> that's wrong. This is a kid's outfit, but they're called petables. I don't think bats are pets. I mean, okay. Okay. Whatever works for you. Pokemon. Charizard. Whatever works for you. I love that colorway. 
Too bad there's a stain there. But... Blues. Love my blues. We won again today. Eight in a row. Last year was a league high for 11 wins in a row. So let's see if we can get to that again and surpass the Tiefen. Blues. Yeah, I was excited when I saw that. Think Apple. Bam. This looks like an older one, too. I'm going to look this up right now because this could be money, money, money. Money. I love finding old computer-related shirts. That's a repop. And they do repop these, it looks like. Well, not, well, they've repopped vintage ones. Let's just put it that way. That vintage one, though, sweatshirt, champion sweatshirt. Oh, no, that's Fomer Simpson. <laughs> Check that out. Fomer Simpson is uh, Windy City Kicks. Huh. He's a sneaker seller out of Chicago. But um, Fomer Simpson was a, is a uh, YouTube sneaker review guy who's been around for a long time. Probably not too far after I was doing it. I started in 09 doing sneaker videos. And just like the thrift stuff, my videos never took off. But all these other people who came, you know, a year or two years or whatever after me, skyrocketed and took off and was making the big money. And here I am, <laughs> not going nowhere. I'm like, ah! So I, I think that's just the way it's going to be. And I'm okay with that. So... For the hundreds of you that do watch, I'm going to treat you just as if there was a million people watching. But Mr. Fomer Simpson released, I guess, a sweatshirt with a little Apple thing on it. Looks like Apple. Saying, think uncivilized? Why would he put... It's got to be here. Why would he put Fomer... Well, that's old. No. Why would he put Fomer Simpson... Mr. Fomer Simpson uncivilized Apple sweatshirt... Well, I guess maybe that was one of his uh, his uh, merchandising things he did. So, 140 bucks though. Interesting. Interesting. I haven't watched his videos in a long time. I need to go back and check that then. So let me put up highest here. See if I can find anything on this one. That is the highest. I think there's another one, Mr. Fomer Simpson. Dude, ain't that so cool? I mean, you're you're freaking known for making shoe videos. You can put out merchandise, and the resale market on the merchandise can freaking top 140 bucks. How kick ass is that? That is just cool as hell. Here's an old Apple shirt with the same Hanes tag on it, but it's a different uh, picture on it. But it's the same period as this one. Uh, for the Cube, Mac G4 Cube, $138 and took a best offer on it. That one looks unworn. What year was that? I'll have to look up the when that Cube came out and see if it's the same year. Looks the same year as the shirt. So there's another one. 80 bucks so about 70 80 bucks for that cube one i have to do more research on this vintage another vintage one though differently think differently 24.99 so i have to dig a little deep into this and see if i can find anything about it i will say the bottom end 25 high end 75 maybe but if I can't find one out there, I'm going to go way up on it just in case. Maybe put like $130 on it and best offer. See what happens. So that's a cool last piece. Maybe I'll get that one up tonight. Throw that one aside. Another Rams jersey or sweatshirt. Kick ass. Kiki's. This was the PGA Tour here in St. Louis, which I've been finding a lot of stuff recently. This was last year. Tiger Woods was here, etc., etc. My boys went down to watch it all. 
And they're like, Tiger Woods walks right by him. Like, they're right front row. He walks right by him. They're taking pictures and stuff. So that's cool. So what size is this? Large. Won't fit either one. My one boy, Adrian, though, he's lost over 50 pounds. So he's dropping the weight. He's He's below me now, I think. Yeah, I think he's a few pounds below me right now. So pretty proud of that. It's cool. Now if I can just get my stuff off. What the hell is that? It's a golf course of some sort. This is vintage. Made in USA, Louisville, Kentucky, Town Talk, Tag. So that's cool. Some good stuff. This is why I'm dedicating myself. I'm christening myself as the hardest working eBayer on YouTube because it takes some work to put this stuff up. I've got let's 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 play a game. Let's maybe I'll set these parameters. If I can find the link I'm looking for here. So should we go US? We're gonna we're gonna keep track of my dollar amounts that I have listed uh, when I do bin hauls. How about that? Let's throw some extra stuff into these bin haul videos. Uh, for the U.S. site alone, retail asking price of merchandise I have listed is two hundred and eighty thousand seven hundred and sixty-one dollars and ninety-three cents. That is. I'm going to write this down, so I'm going to keep track of it, and we're going to keep track of it. So that is U.S. only. But if I do all the eBay sites, we'll keep a running total of that, too. Because it takes 20,000, it only does 20,000 of my listings and moves them to the eBay sites. Sorry, 20,000 per site. Uh, that's what you get for free. And I haven't seen nothing about the web interpret uh, extension yet into next year. So I hope that's still going to be holding up. They haven't sent out any emails that I've seen yet. So this thing is eBay's taking forever. So the total value of merchandise on all of my eBay sites. So that's duplicate items. $1,782,913.54. So we're going to keep that. Actually, that's probably the lowest I've ever seen it. Because it was up over $2 million at one point. So I'm going to keep notes of that and see if I'm uh, listing more than I'm selling. Because I'd like to stay listing more than I'm selling. Because that's how you get your money going up 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 so all right there's my junk i'm gonna list so got a few good things i'm gonna list quick that should get all the money back in one you know a few items will pay for all this if not just the one item so cute i'm happy i gotta organize and count process thanks everybody for watching please like comment subscribe whatever you want to do throw a party watch a white boy dance anything you want uh -uh. shop at urban-picker.com Later.